All right, section 2.2, we'll split this up into a couple different videos. This first one here, we're going to be talking about the properties of exponents. A couple of examples, and then in the second video, we'll do some more practice problems. Here's some key information. We have a to the n, so it's a raised to the n power, where n is our exponent, a is our base. Next one we have is a to the 0 equals 1. That means that any number raised to the 0 power equals 1. 1 raised to the 0, 2 raised to the 0, 3 raised to the 0. The next one is a raised to the negative n. Now it's saying anything raised to a negative exponent. We can rewrite it as 1 over a to the positive n. So for an example, let's say we have 3 raised to the negative fourth. Well, we can rewrite that as 1 over 3 raised to the positive fourth. And lastly, we have n raised to the a over b equals the b root of n raised to the a power. Let's do an example with this one. Let's say I have 5 raised to the 4 thirds. Let's rewrite that. Well, I'm going to have the we have b here. So that's our 3, so it's going to go on the outside. The cube root of 5 raised to the a, which is our 4 here. So we have the cube root of 5 raised to the 4th power. And you can go back and forth with these. These you can go either way. So if you see it written in radical form, that's what we have over here on the right. If you see it written in radical form, you can move it to exponential form. And you can go the other direction. So in the next video, we'll do a couple more examples with these exponent properties.